TLE6 Agriculture Multi-cropping plan slash layout for plantation expansion Objectives At the end of 50 minutes, 100% of the learners are expected to Perform propagation of trees and fruit trees following agricultural standards set in the industry Review What are the different strategies in marketing trees and fruit trees? To put up a nursery, one must consider the following requirements. 1. Location or site. Choose a place near a source of water. 2. Soil type. Different plants need different types of soil. But for young plants, the most common soil used is the loam type, rich in organic matter. 3. Shed. This is one structure essential in propagating young trees. A shed should have a partially lighted roof to allow sunlight for the young tree to grow. 4. Storage place for tools and equipment. It is important to have a complete set of tools or their substitute to be able to carry out all nursery activities properly. 5. Boxes, pots, and plots for germinating seeds. There are three places to germinate seeds, young plants, and young trees. Boxes and plots are usually used for germinating seeds. Pots or plastic bags are usually used for young trees. The place where fruit trees are propagated is called a nursery. Today, there are plants along the highways, besides roads, and streets, and inside towns and cities. With perseverance, work, and creativity, the plant nursery becomes a profitable business. As a requirement, you must have adequate knowledge and skills in planting and taking care of the plants. Generalization What are the requirements needed in putting up a nursery? When is the proper time to propagate trees and fruit trees? <laughs>